Hello Revolutionaries, this is Dave Newbury, Director of Coaching, and in this brief presentation I'm going to be outlining the formations we use in the 11v11, 9v9, 7v7 and 4v4 formats. To begin with, we'll discuss the 11v11, and as you can see on this diagram, we have 11 markers on the field numbered 1 to 11, representing the 11 players on the field. Similar to most top clubs in the country, our entire club will be working to play this formation. Starting with our juniors program, our five and six year olds, the players will learn to play the positions and the functional responsibilities. The 1442 has four lines of defense and attack. The defensive line starts with the goalkeeper, number one. The next line of defense, the back four, includes a number two, a right back, a number three, a left back, and two central defenders, number four and five. The third line, the midfield line, includes a number seven, wide right, and number 11, wide left. The central midfield pairing of the number six and number eight is staggered, with the number six playing more defensive and the number eight playing higher or more attacking. The fourth line includes two strikers, the number nine and number 10. The number nine is always our highest player and our number 10 plays underneath or in support of the number nine. In the 9v9 format, we reduce our players by two. In this case, the two players that are missing from the 11v11 format are the number five central defender and the attacking central midfield player. We maintain a back three, a midfield three, and two up front, and of course, the goalkeeper. In the 7v7 format, the two players that are sacrificed are the two wide midfield players, number seven and number 11. We maintain a back three, the number two, three and four, a central midfield, number six, and two strikers, and of course, again, the goalkeeper. Our youngest players play a 4v4 format without goalkeepers. We create a diamond formation consisting of the number four central defender, the right and left side, both defense and attacking the number two and number three, and the striker, the number nine. Beginning with the end in mind, our coaches will start to teach the youngest players in our club how to play the functional responsibilities of players in the 11v11 format, starting with the 4v4, 7v7, and progressing on from the 9v9 into the 11 versus 11. In future presentations, we'll talk about the tactical and systematic responsibilities of players and the team.